All right, guys, so what we're going to do is unbox the Logitech 4K Brio. This is actually going to be an upgrade to my Logitech 920 1080p webcam. And uh, I'm pretty excited about this because, well, we do the Review Dork Show and we used a webcam and I was not entirely uh, satisfied with the video quality of it. So, yeah. Got this cool package here. Thank you, Amazon. Thank you, Logitech, for uh, giving me some hope here. Uh, this was on Amazon. I found it for $199. I'll go ahead and include a link in the description below. But uh, yeah, you guys know me for horrible reviews or unboxings, and uh, this won't be any better, but I'll give it a shot. Okay, so let's talk about what is in the box. Basically, you're getting a camera, a USB cable, a privacy shade, a carrying pouch, and documentation. A carrying pouch? What the hell? I'm going to keep this on my computer. I'm not carrying it anywhere. So, hold on. Yeah. Ah, there you go. All right, guys, so one of the first things I noticed in opening this right now is that it is much, much bigger than the Logitech C920. And um, actually, I should just go ahead and get the baby brother just to show you. And like magic, there you go. So we have the baby brother here, the Logitech C920. And I tell you what, guys, I'll end up giving this guy away absolutely free. Just make sure you like, share, subscribe. It retails at Best Buy for about... 59 or 69 dollars and I can include a link down to Amazon should you decide you want to buy this thing brand new But if you have a gaming channel or if you do a lot of video conferencing or a lot of Skype or talking to family and all the such this little guy will absolutely do the trick and uh, again, if you have a video game channel, this is great where you can capture your most defeating moments while you're actually playing the game. Basically a video overlay to your gameplay so, you know, people can see your excitement, your failure, your accomplishments, your anguish, and defeat! To my favorite comment, make sure the snot comes out my nose, I'll be giving this away absolutely free. Keep that in mind. Now, um, one thing that I did notice about this and I really enjoyed is the plastic mount, guys. And you can see we got the thread down in the bottom for the tripod. And um, yeah, this was a nifty little camera. Uh, basically got this when we started our YouTube channel 500 subscribers ago. But for the Review Dork Show, and I will also include a link down in the description, I figured I needed better video quality as myself and C4 Destroyer. Pretty much go at it and talk about the latest and greatest in video game news and tech and um, well I wasn't too happy with my video quality in comparison but like I said not to take anything away from this guy here he's done his job again amazing video but we live in an age of 4k video and I said why the hell not you know just check this out I found it on Amazon for about $199 and I will also include a link down below in the description you guys can check it out for yourself and um, again if you look at the size comparison the Brio 4k is much bigger well I can't say much bigger but sizably bigger or definitely noticeable and I believe that has to do with the new uh camera sensor and a few other things. Another thing, we have the USB port down in the back. As opposed to the C920, yeah, it's pretty much connected. And you would just go ahead and plug this into a USB port and you're rocking and rolling, right? Um, yeah, and I didn't see a screw to mount this onto a tripod until I broke it and then realized that there's a thread down in the bottom, which is really, really cool. So I can go ahead and mount this to my Gorilla tripod. Now, I'm not going to go ahead and get into specs, guys, because, well, I'm sure there's plenty of other videos out there talking about the specs. One thing that we do know is that I will record at 4K, 30 frames per second, and I will be able to record 1080p at 60 frames per second. And um, I'll be using this a lot, especially with my driving games. You guys will get to be able to see my reaction as I smack the wall. Yeah, that'll be pretty cool. Anyways, okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to get this connected to the computer and uh, check out its video quality. I'll also compare the video quality to this little guy here. Again, I'm giving this away absolutely free. So make sure you like, share, subscribe. And um, yeah, let's put this to the side here and let's see what else comes in the box. Let's see if uh, they're lying to us as to 
what comes in the box. So, here we go. Uh, yeah, some sort of clip here. I'll figure this out. And um, some instructions. Yeah, who cares? And, all right, and here we got the USB cable. And, uh, yeah, just plug it into a USB 2.0. And you should be... Uh, Rocking and rolling with your video. And, of course, a pouch. Now, I don't understand why this thing comes with a pouch. But, and, and more importantly, why the pouch is, like, so big. I can literally just fit my whole entire hand in here. And, uh, I mean, like, seriously? Yeah. Like, it looks like, I don't know, a Christmas stocking, basically. Well, thank you for the pouch. <laughs> Oversized pouch. I'll never be using this. Anyways, guys, that's pretty much it for the unboxing. Let's uh, connect this to the computer and uh, check out its video quality. All right, guys, so what we're looking at is the Logitech C920. And, well, as you can see, it's still a phenomenal image. I have low light coming in. I'm basically sitting behind a curtain, and all that's lighting up my office here is the light from the outside. And the curtains are closed, so go figure. This has amazing low light performance. You can see there's a little bit of a redness to my skin tone, but uh, I'm sure that that can be fixed with color correction, post edit. And again, this is a phenomenal little uh, webcam, especially for gamers or if you want to jump on Skype and Skype with your family, that kind of thing. But for gamers, if you know you want to record your reactions, you know you want to record the excitement, the defeat, the agony. This is a great webcam, and again, you can find it at Best Buy or Amazon anywhere from $49 to $69. But who cares, right? Because you're going to leave a funny comment down below, and I'm going to pick my favorite funny comment, and I'm going to go ahead and ship this amazing little webcam, the Logitech C920. I'm going to ship it to you absolutely free. So make sure you like, share, subscribe. Now what we're going to do, and this is the part I'm excited about, is jump on the Logitech Brio and see what it looks like in 4K. I'm really excited about that. Okay, so this is the Logitech Brio at 1080p, 60 frames per second, and the audio hearing is actually coming from this amazing little webcam. And I'm looking at the preview screen here and I see amazing low light performance, which is really, really consistent with the Logitech webcams. You know, they are known for amazing low light performance, but one thing that stands out when I'm looking at myself is that there's more of a natural representation of colors. None of that redness going on. And I, I'm very, very happy with the way this looks at 1080p, 60 frames per second, but we're not done yet. We still have to go to 4K! Oh wow, this is me on 4K. I am one handsome Bella here. No, actually, I'm still an ugly son of a bitch, but this is 4K. This is what you can expect at 4K 30 frames per second, and I think it's an amazing uh, video. Like, wow, it, it, I dare say it's, an, it's a better video than my Canon 70D, like, honestly. Well, the Canon 70D can't record 4K. It can't even record 1080 past 30 frames per second, but... I'm looking at this and I'm saying, wow, this is a significant upgrade. And again, you're hearing the audio. Uh, I am not using this thing here. As you can see, I have it unplugged. So we're not using the Blue Yeti. You're hearing the audio that's coming right from this little webcam. Now, there's something I wanted to point out. And just give me a second here while I do that. Is um, look at the cable here. Look at how thick this cable is here and I would expect it to be because it seems like you know it just has to pump more data to your PC so yeah I I, I, I really enjoyed this guys this is $199 on Amazon I'll include a link down in the description below but we're not done yet what I want to do is I want to check out the software the Logitech software specific to the Brio and that means we're going on my computer screen see you soon all right, guys, so when you get this camera, one of the first things you want to do is install the drivers, right? And when you install the drivers, you get Logitech camera settings, and then you have, like, this control panel right here, which is pretty cool. You could go ahead and zoom, and you can pan uh, left, right, up, down, 
without having to actually physically touch the camera. You can set your focus. Uh, that's pretty pretty cool. Uh, we can go on over to image and here you could adjust brightness, contrast, and autofocus. And speaking of autofocus, I want you guys to check this out. Look at that autofocus there. That autofocus is really, really, really amazing. And um, let's go on over to, actually, color settings. Oh my god! Okay, never mind. Uh, yeah. Uh, get this back down to 50. Okay. Let's go on over to settings and obviously you have your anti-flicker at 60 hertz. Um, you can also change your field of view. 65 degrees. 78 degrees. 90 degrees. But one of my favorite things is uh, widescreen. I really like the widescreen. Now, there are also drivers that you can include or download that uh, will allow you to green screen the back. I'm not really going to go into green screening, at least at this point. But um, this is a phenomenal little camera. and certainly an upgrade to the Logitech uh, C920. And, you know, again, I can't complain with that little camera, but... This is proving to be worth every dollar. At $199, you can find it in Amazon. I'll go ahead and include a link down in the description below. And you know what? If you like this video, make sure you like, share, subscribe. Leave comments down below. Got any questions? Leave them down below. But this is Gabe with Review Dork. Peace!